this was May the 11th. It was addressed. Oh, the day before. It was his yeah. very last letter. Yeah. That it was mine? written May the 10th. Is that mine? No, this is mine. Remember, oh, I'm the one that got it in the mail. Oh. Um, he just said, you know, dear Susan, I received your letter in the film today. Thanks for the film. Um, are you ready for graduation? You mentioned something about gowns. I'd like to see you wear a mint green or an aqua. Of course, it's up to you. By the way, who's taking you to the prom? You never mentioned it. Um, I'll get you something for your graduation when you get home. I guess you know I'm going to Gannon Air Force Base, New yeah, Mexico. Yeah, Cannon Air Force Base. Yeah, Cannon Air Force Base, and I was, it's in New Mexico. I was disappointed at first, but it's in the States, so I'm glad. So what's mom getting upset for? Just because I'll soon be 20? <laughs> Hell, that's still young. <laughs> I'm still young, and so is dad. And if she's worried now, wait till I'm 30. And what do you mean I shouldn't write such sad letters? I don't feel my letters are sad to write, but that's how I feel. Um, besides, I'm a sad person when I think about home. What do you mean um, you had a dream about me coming home? What is that all about? It's kind of funny in a way. I'm looking forward to all the pictures and setting and um, of Lana sitting on my lap. Um, I'm supposed to be subconsciously thinking of everything else, but sometimes I do daydream. Um, this was about other girls he was writing. He says, well, that's all over now. And let's see. I guess um, there's nothing else to write about. I'm sure you uh, you'd need to give mom $10 a week. And that's not very much money, so you can still make payments on your TV and have enough spending money left for yourself. Try it for a while and see how it works. Take care. Love, Gary.